Chatty chatty, motor massy, mix up, why you not love Richie business, leave Richie business alone. Good God I tell you, nasty nigga, nosy neighbor your friends want fix up, why you not love Richie business, leave Richie business alone. Dirty nigga. Good afternoon. Dirty nigga, you may have chat. Nobody call me. I have a block you. How do you do? How do you do alright? How do you do in a way? I never talk to one of the women them. I have to come like King Mix up and say, boom. Trust, back again with this quick update. I know if it's not forwarding from Kick Mix Up, it's not real. I know King Mix Up them thing. Then, anyway, the woman them will have children. I want to talk to her and tell her something. I don't try to change nobody. But I realize the society I swing social media way right now. Social media I make you feel like say everybody rich, everybody have it together, and everybody this and everybody that and everybody one bag of thing. Now all of the females them Somehow I've done gone bad already. I'm gonna label myself as bad bitch. I'm gonna label myself as that bitch. I'm gonna label myself as everything. But remember this. One thing me learn every woman is supposed to be a queen. If you don't act like a queen, you're not gonna be treated like a queen. A man will treat you how you treat yourself. And if you treat yourself a certain way and him no one treat you so that means you have the wrong man. Zin? No. Not because go che I hear one alone I go in and out. You hear one alone I go out go che. See? So, when I try to say to you now, I put up a post a while ago. I say, see a next queen here. I see a girl come on from my page. And the girl say, I forgive respect where respect you. Because Shensia killed um, the verse and the girl this and the girl that. See? Remember you now? I put up a video with a girl that do a freestyle. I say, see a next queen here. I say, a next queen, you know. See? And this girl coming from my page and say, I forget credit where credit you. Then no credit me get to a next queen. Idiot girl. See? Remember this, you know. A woman should be labeled as a queen. All of the man them will follow me if you get any youth, especially if you get a daughter, treat your daughter like a princess and make she grow into a queen. You are supposed to be your daughter's first love. Don't make social media tell your daughter say she a bad bitch or she a this or she a that. Come I realize enough people say them have education and them go to university and them give but them not really have no whole heap of smarts. They have the education but them not use it the right way. Zin, and a long time this me teach my daughter them something here. But I always teach my daughter, you're a queen. Treat yourself like a queen and any boy. 
feel like him want to treat you less of a queen. That's why I tell, enough time when I hear some woman that talk about the man do them this and the man do them that and the man do them this and the man that. Them cause it upon themselves because they put themselves in the situation and them drop them standard. Don't drop your standard for nobody. You hear me say? Enough of these girls have never been told that they are a queen. So all of a sudden now, spice a queen. Only think a spice alone a queen? Only feel like say just dance all queen alone about as a woman you are a queen. As a woman, you are a queen. You're supposed to be treated like a queen. You're not supposed to be treated like a whore or a bitch. You're supposed to be treated like the woman you are. Are the woman you are supposed to be. Remember, no found no, on the parents grown on one way and then on the turn a different way. No found have never been told that you are beautiful before. No found still a search for that on social media. That's why when you put up all a picture and when you see it get all 20 likes, so now I wonder, oh, it get 20 likes, I want to take it down, I want to put it up back. Because you're so vulnerable. Only so vulnerable and worry about what social media have to say. Oh, so I forgot to tell my sister that. You don't know my sister. So, oh, yeah, tell me, forgot to tell my sister that. I don't know me that, I don't know me that comment the gopher. I don't know me that comment the gopher. And I made a comment to go for. Remember again. Women. Remember this you know. Respectfully. You first respect yourself. You hear? You first. That means if people go to a man tell you say. You're this and you're that and you're supposed to do this and you do that. You're supposed to know what you want to do. You hear? You say a lot of uno. Uno blame selector for all heap of things. Uno blame selector and say a selector this and selector that and selector this and selector that and selector. Uno blame selector for everything. See? And sometimes do you see some uno act? Sometimes the way I see some man act. Watch the attention seeker. Yeah. This is a little youth where I look at attention. I can't bother giving a man no attention right now. But they are not talking about females. And some little guy come on. And sometimes it just begs me more time. You know, say, you could have seen them and I'll thump them in them face and see how bad them is. Make your name just have it out. Sometimes you would have wish you could have had that something the way you just draw them in and say, defend your talk where you just make a while ago. That are the thing. I wish, say, you could have just have that sometime. Because I guess what? Everybody bad on social media until you see them in a real life, you know. You know what I mean? Everybody bad until you see them in a real life. And you thump them in them face now, them tell you say, no, I joke them did I run. Then, but, again, the woman them, some of them take up some unnecessary problems on social media. And, I understand that everybody have them favorite artists. I understand everybody have them favorite artists, everybody have them favorite song. And no for go hard for an artist. But remember, you have to go twice as hard for yourself like how you go hard for the artist. Because the artist have who them like. The artist is human being. You understand? I see someone on the, on the internet, I understand. To someone run out for people and go on for people. You don't have to go on so for yourself. Put in that energy there on yourself. You don't have to put in more effort in on yourself. You hear? You don't have to put in that effort there. Because remember this, you know, one of the easiest ways to get somebody's attention is to say something bad about them. 
I understand all of that. When you come on the internet and you talk too much good things, you say too much positive things. You're too nice for the internet. Them say you're boring. But once you go to a man come on and you mention somebody name who have any relevance, come on. Over the page, you're nice. It have a buzz. See? It have a buzz. But I'm telling you about buzz. There's no thing as an everlasting buzz. A buzz is like when you smoke or drink and you catch a high. That high can give you an hangover and then it wear off. It lasts for a couple of days sometime and then it wear off. And you take a while and say you nah, do it again because your body feel away. Your body feel away. And remember you know, me not perfect you know. But me have sense. Before me come on pan live and go on like say. Before I come up on live and go on like some better than people, I'm rather than come on. Because I can't pretend. See? I can't pretend. So let's say the buzz is the new talk for the little youths them now. Or the kids them talk that now. Because there was other talks before. See? There was other talk before. But I still emphasize upon this. Females who have daughters. Try to make sure... You tell your daughter about self-worth. She needs to be taught. This is something that she needs to be taught until she understands. When you are having conversation, you make sure she understand about what is self-worth and what is morals. Because remember, it's not everybody I go suck with and make it in a life. And not everybody I go lick out about you and make it in a life. You have other girls who do it. Y'all them piss on them and shit on them and do them all kind of things and them get bends. Yes, some of them get trips, some of them get here, some of them get everything. But what good for the goose don't good for the gander. What is for you can be for your next man. So these things now where the parents come into play now. You have to sit down with your child. When you sit down with your child, especially when your daughter is going into that teenager stage. Whether she live in Jamaica or whether she live in her next country. These are the things that you have to do because remember things catch them eye upon the internet. Things catch them eye. Nobody tells nobody on the, uh, 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 on the TV about self-worth. I don't see it. I watch the cartoon them, them not teach you about self-worth. You watch the movie, them, them not teach you about self worth. Them show you people that take coke, them show you girl a strip and corner, them show you who are go go, them show you all of these people. You are the one who's supposed to be teaching your child these things, because these things don't, they, it, it's not taught in the schools. Self worth is not taught in the school. They said to love yourself, but how do you love yourself? You have to teach a person how to love themselves. You have to teach people. How to love themselves. You don't just get up and say, Oh, you have to love yourself. What do you mean? Explain. Expon. How do you love yourself? How does one love themselves? When you start believing in yourself. First thing we have to believe in yourself. Do you believe that you can brush your teeth and brush your teeth properly? There's a start. Do you believe you can clean your nostrils and clean them properly? You believe you can wash your face and matter in your eye and you wash it out properly? That's how you know you believe or you hear good job. You start telling you them good job. Good job. You start from small things. Then you start teach the youth them how to wash the plates. You move them from plates to pots. Because the food in the pot, sometimes the food, the bun bun in the pot and it won't scrape out. And then they might use a scotch bright when they use a scour scour. These are things where you sit down with the children them. No found on a like when I talk the truth. Because you don't know so you're busy sit down and I worry about the Kardashian and them. Well, you don't never see them a cook yet. All you don't see them a do a advertise makeup and clothing line. A people cook for them. One time I see Kim Kardashian say she a cook rice and peas. One time you don't see she a do it. And them do these things for the camera. Cause them have them nice, nice meal. We, we, we cook for them and them how much five and ten chef. See? And everybody sit down and watch that. Keeping up with the Kardashians. And housewife of Atlanta. And housewife of Hollywood. And housewife of Mal and, and all of them place there. See? 
And then now we so busy sit down and caught up another show there and the youth they sit down and I watch it too. See? So now, how do you teach a child about self-worth? When they go to school, they're going to hear that children, you have to hear that children tell them say them shoes with them have on and a brand. Now they're going to feel like them can fit in because them shoes are not brand because them now we are desert clocks that are school or them now we are Nike or Jordan or whatever them now we are going school them can fit in you need to teach you youth them say it's okay to stand out them now for fit in can remember tell you youth them say them born by themselves so them have to learn to enjoy them own company remember one time gone when light gone when light gone, you know, everybody goes a bam and sit down and get around and start tell story and dime for light come back. Now when light gone, everybody becks because they can't get for look by Instagram. Them can't get for look by Instagram because guess what them want to wag one over pink wall and wag one over chapics and wag one over the page. Yeah. And one girl with them a look pan with a girl ever in a pay bangarang. See in? They can't wait for the light come back and everybody want to look in the WhatsApp group with them in the sex WhatsApp group. Why go on in there? In the, in the, 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 it, it's spicy and true light. Can't, them can't get for sending this and sending that. See? Yes, we in a different era. We can't get back time. So these are the things we have to sit down and do now with you them. Because remember, you know, we don't get fuck already, you know. But we can save the generation by helping them save themselves. You hear me, I say? So, when I tell you, I say, all females are queen. Every female is a queen. And she has to know how to wear her crown. She have to know how to fit that crown, how to walk with that crown, how to bear that crown. Because that crown on your head should be worn with grace. You hear me say? Worn with grace. Look at girl, paper. Watch my little jacket daughter come on. After I carry her Japan somewhere this morning and come back to my yard. She has come to me and I don't like her. You see me I tell her she's wicked. Remember you know? She tell me to drop her somewhere. She never tell me to wait for her. I drop her and go about my business. I drop her and go about my business. You have a jacket. You never tell me what time to come back neither. You never tell me what time to come back. And then I come ask me about, are you home? Yes, me done with you. I done, me done with you. What you do for my page too? So you still have come attack about, uh, over my page. You feel leave over ya. Me just tell the people I'm going to like you. And you have a jacket. Come over my page and I come about. I don't like you. You know me don't like you. I'm glad you recognize me don't like you. And that you think you're born you you say I don't like you. I'm a jacket daughter. She's a kid. But she's alright. I'm glad you never like me. That's why I'm not come back for you. So this son of bun you know you're back to you and you see if you're driving her. Bun you you. Talk about my pine I have in my fridge. Me a drink pine and ginger and bun you. I make you hurt and feel a way. Remember you know. When I tell you this paper. No for you know. I understand. You know son a child is a replica of. On own self. See? And what most parents do wrong, like most mothers, they wear 
a body rider shot with them body jar show. Them try to get one exactly. Make this little three, four year old, five year old, six year old, seven year old. Make the same shots like the little girl. Make belly skin a show. And all of these things as a six, seven, eight year old because they say that's my replica, that's my twin. Remember, we have to set example. Not because we like something, we think it's appropriate for our children to wear. Because so much predators are out the road. Because remember, say, some of our, 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 our baby mothers are our wife. Them shape good. Them shape good bad. So the little girl come with the exact shape. And her body start fill out quick. So when you put on certain clothes on this little baby here, yeah, you think that them dirty predator boy and you know, I look. And remember, you cannot watch your children 24-7. You cannot watch your children 24-7. We don't know who is watching us because them say a child shall lead the way and a village should raise a child. See? And we see it so much time because we want to match with the youth them. So now when I talk about self-worth, when this little youth I go to come in ball, I will love party. But party nowadays, nobody feel like I'm a ring ding. And a, and a pop goes the weasel. And the same music them we are playing. Because remember the selector we are about. Me can't play on a children party. Yes, me can make a CD with the pity them song. But when me go to a man and, and, and go to this party. Yeah. And the little pity them there. Then I make the stallion and them I deal it. But, and, and then my talk about what? And them bad and bougie and all of them something there. And then some know say me I leave music alone and go do farming. Because of them thing they are going and they look up in them party now because remember what we allow because them don't determine what them listen to them party. I feel them party but we are paying feet so we say listen to me. It's supposed to be appropriate, not inappropriate. And I watch them I broke out and I whine and I go on and when you see them I whine we are cheer them on boy. Yeah me daughter. Yeah me daughter. Yeah me daughter. That same daughter where I say yeah me daughter. Your boots are up your daughter. But her birthday she can get a little drink and you give her things for drink. We have to take responsibility for our own actions. We have to be held accountable. Zin? So now, there's a lot of females who are 35. A lot of them is 40. They have never heard, I love you. They have never felt love before. And when I say felt love, Love is something where people just all about you. Them just are you. They like anything where you say that them are do. Them just all about you. Them if your head hurt you, them want to get the pill. Them want to get the water. Them want to feed you it. Them want because if you lay down and say to hurt you, them go to and say ingrown. Come and help you take it out. Telling us I love you and showing us I love you is two different things. When we did little. Our parents never used to tell we said them love we. We used to get good treatment. Like we get with nice clothes and them beard we and them comb we here and you know. Them treat we certain way and them beat with everything and say a true and people and say a true your parents love you and them want good for you. Now we are in a different era. Beaten don't raise the child anymore. Because remember, all of us. When we used to get beaten, did we hear? Don't we still go back and do the same thing? Don't we still, when them said, don't leave the yard, don't we still leave the yard? So now you have a child and your member say, you was 12 and you was 13 and you was 14 and you was 20. You now go member say, you was those age. So the way your child is acting now, you don't feel like say you have to go sit down now and beg the child do. Because you could have beat the child look more and nobody never just put out them pitney and left the pitney to the mercy of the world and then wonder where them pitney asleep. Putting out your child out of the house doesn't change the child either. Because now we in a serious time where you can put out the child and the child find themselves a Trelawney. And you don't see back that child till she have a pitney and the pitney are four or five or you don't see that back that youth until me in the wrong company and you hear say men up a jail or you hear say dead you hear say and then you see him one because what we have to put out with you them for? 
Because a real parent never give up on them child. We talk and talk and talk until the vice box gone. And when they get back the vice box, we talk and talk and talk again. While you have some people just give up and say, let them go on. If they want to go dead, they go on go dead. No real parents say that. We say it, yes, but we don't mean it. Because as night come down, where are they? Where are they? Where are they? See? So now, when you hear, so the youth they must learn to stand out. You see, standing out is a big thing for me. You can be bullied at school. Them can tell you about your shoes. Them can tell you about your hair. And them love to tell people about them hair. Teach the youth them to love them natural hair. Please, may I beg you. Teach the youths them to love their natural hair. Because they're on these YouTubes and, and everywhere. And them watching these tall, um, tall hair kids. These white kids. And these foreign kids with them tall hair. So as holiday come, the first thing them want to do is put in braids. And act like the pit of them with them I watch. Pan YouTube. Act like the pit of them with them I watch. Pan Disney. Teach your kids to love their natural hair. You never love your natural ear. Please teach you to love them natural ear. Many times when you cream on your ear and put in all kind of things till on your head nyam out. I know some of the head not grow but the amount of glue in it. The amount of glue in your head. It, it, it dig out your ear. It tear out your ear so much. Tear out your ear. Nothing wrong with wearing a wig, you know. Now get me wrong, you know. But Richie, our parents deal with your son or daughter that love the same sex. That's that 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 still. All right, you see that topic there. You see that topic there now. May I tell you the truth? I want a serious topic. It's a serious, serious topic. That way you just say a while ago. How does a parent love him that child where love? Like a a, a youth decides to say a boy him love. Or a girl who decides a girl she love. Big man thing. Big man thing. It never happened to me yet. But as I say, a real parent now give up on them child. Because again, your child will make some decision in life. You will not love it. But you have to live with it because they are the ones that are going to have to deal with the consequences of the choices that they make. You can take them to a point, but they have to carry themselves to the rest of the way. You know what I mean? We were grown in a way where they say man to man is unjust, so man to woman is unjust. Yes. Because that's how we come see it. We come see mother and father. See? But remember again, you can only take the child to a certain point. The rest of the way, they are going to have to find that way. They are the ones that are going to have to find that way. We not going to like it. Some things we are going to do with that, I'm going to talk to some man where we not going to like. With son, I'm going to talk to some girl where we not going to like. But at the end of the day, I feed them life. You understand? I feed them life. Because guess what now? You see, true most of we grow with child, we come be exactly like we. That's how we go wrong. Not how we grow the child, we come be exactly like we. Because I'm a lawyer, my daughter's supposed to be a lawyer. My son, I'm a footballer, my son's supposed to play football. Not necessarily. Not necessarily because if you are an electrician, that doesn't mean your son wants to be an electrician. He, that, that is why he has a mind of his own. What do you want to be when you grow up? These are conversations that we always have with our children. So when your child said to you that, Mom, I want to be a fireman. Or I want to be a, a engineer. 